Hey, what's up guys? So you may have encountered a problem that I've encountered, and that's that uh, this blue light, it looks cool having this open, you know, canopy with the lights coming down, but if you put your tank somewhere, like maybe a living room or your office, it actually can be pretty distracting and annoying. I mean, you can even just see how I look on camera. I look kind of funny with all this blue light in here. And I wanted to show you how I made a quick, easy solution um, to that. It was fairly cost effective. It was probably more cost effective than building out like a full wooden canopy. But basically all I did was make this guy right here. And this is made out of foam board. Um, and it's black and it's held together with black silicone. Actually somebody I work with made it. Shout out to Mike. Thanks a bunch for making this for me. And um, let me just show you a little bit of how he made it. And what's nice is that it's super light. You can see I can pick it up easy with one hand. Um, and you know, it's just easy to maneuver. If my tank was a little bit smaller, I'd probably be able to do it myself. I might even be able to do it myself, but I'm worried about damaging something, breaking it, or knocking one of these lights over or something. If you had a smaller tank, like maybe a 55 or a 75 gallon, I think you'd be able to build one of these no problem and be able to just, you know, pop it off and pop it on real easily, which is nice that you don't have this huge, you know, heavy piece of, you know, wood or steel to deal with. So let's take a look at this real quick. So you can see it's held together with black silicone. Maybe you can't see it that well. And then we have these little stoppers in the corners and sides that just actually sits on top of this right here. So this edge actually comes over and then it sits on these little stoppers. And I have these little cutouts for the braces on my lights. So let me just show you what a big difference it makes. And this was just driving me crazy because this is in my actual office. I'll show you what it looks like when I try to do like a Zoom meeting or a Google Hangout call. I was literally like just completely blue, blasted blue. And I always just kind of didn't like the way it looked and it would just drive me nuts all day. This is what I look like when I have this blue thing. You can see I'm like blue and I just look ridiculous when I'm trying to do a meeting, which was annoying. And just seeing this blue light, I felt like it was kind of disrupting my, I don't know, mood, maybe my circadian rhythm or whatever you call it. Funny story is I went to go get glasses and they said, hey, you know, you can get like glasses that change color. So when you're outside in the sun, they turn into sunglasses. Are you interested in that? It's like, that sounds like a great idea. I would love that. And then as I was filling out the paperwork, I suddenly had the thought, wait a minute, this is putting out UV light. What if I wear them in my office? It'll probably turn into sunglasses and then I won't be able to see my computer screen and stuff. So it's just one little extra little thing where this can actually become kind of more annoying than it is cool. Um, so let me just show you how much this changes it when I put the lid on. What a difference, huh? Now look, I'm not blue anymore. You can still enjoy the tank. It still looks great, but all that light is blocked out. And let me show you what I look like on a meeting now. All right, this is what I look like with the canopy on the tank. You can still see the tank looks good, but a uh, lot better look if you ask me. So yeah, I just wanted to make this video real quick. If you're considering putting up a tank and you're wondering if you should have an open canopy or a closed canopy, this is something to consider. And if you already have a tank and it was an open canopy and you are starting to notice that it's bothering you a bit, here is a solution where you can do it yourself. It's pretty cost effective relative to other alternatives and methods. Um, so let me know what you think down in the comments below. Let me know if you have any other ideas that would have been a good solution to something like this. And thanks for watching. I know I haven't made videos in a long time, but I have a lot of new content coming up. So like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, and I'll see you in the next one.